looking to get something like a toy robot kit that could eventually grow up to become a much more advanced robot, maybe something that feels like a home robot that you could program, maybe you want something like Sphero Rover. Sphero has made a lot of robot balls and toys. You may have seen Spider-Man, R2-D2. The Rover is much more of a robot kit that a developer would use. And the Rover is going to be hitting in the fall for probably around $249, and there's a Kickstarter campaign for it now. It is like in a little RC Rover, and you can see here it holds uh, 10 pounds, can move about eight miles an hour, and it can connect not just with Sphero's programming apps and EDU, but it can connect with Raspberry Pi and other coding kits if you want to attach them to the top and connect them with a serial port. That could mean that you could develop this to do all sorts of things that the other Sphero toys can't do. And if you've been following the Sphero spin-off Misty Robotics, which is a home robot that is a, a much more expensive, higher-end device made for robotic programmers, well, this is kind of an in-between. Another cool thing on the rover is this color sensor here. This is meant to sense colors and transmit them very fast over Bluetooth. And what do you do with that? Well, Sphero acquired this company called Spectrums. I got to look at these uh, color playing rings that turn color into music. Pretty cool, and the idea is that tech was moved into here. Sphero is gonna have color-coded cards that you could lay on the ground that when the rover rolls over them, reads them and interprets them as different actions. Or you can maybe even build coding mats or draw your own, use it to build boundaries for it. So it's another way to interact with this that's very tactile and color-based. Down the road, Sphero wants to build custom toppers for this in addition to Raspberry Pi kits. That could be things like Wi-Fi cameras and other things you could build. Maybe you build a robot arm for this. Maybe you just run around with it and use it as a crazy fast robot rover in your house. So this is still a prototype and the app that it's using is not the final version. But it's an interesting to look at where toys and programming robots for kids in schools could meet more advanced robotics down the road. Hey, thanks for watching. What do you think about it? Do you program? Are you interested in robot kits? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more.